RC Davis with Eric Moreland, 6'10 forward out of Oregon State. How'd the workout go today? It went good. Uh, it's exactly what I expected. Uh, competitive, uh, go, get after it from the get go, and uh, you know, just show these coaches that we competed. I think you did get after. You got two holes in uh, your uh, leggings I, there. I do, man. I was diving on the floor. At, uh, you know, I probably could have got some Nike Pro ones, but you know, I got some <laughs> leggings on. And, you know, that's what happens when we, we play hard. So We joke about it, but those are the things that these guys are going to look at. They're yes. not going to look if you go 10 for 10 from the field. They're uh, going to look and see if you're diving for you know, this ball. You know, you're not going to come into the league and, you know, get about 10 shots away, like uh, 10 shots a game like you did in college or uh, 15 shots a game. You know, they want to see the intangibles. They want to see the 50-50 balls. They want to see you diving on the floor, see who comes up with the ball. So, uh, you know, those are the things they want to see and, uh, you know, to fill in their roster and, and uh, put together a winning team. You haven't been a forward for very long, so I don't even want to ask you if you're a three or a four. Yeah. You were a guard in high school. Yeah. Uh, talk about that transformation. I think you you had a really big growth spurt. I did. I did in high school. I started off at six foot, and then I wow. went to six eight to six nine uh, within those four years. So, uh, you know, I've been a guard my whole life, and uh, that's why you know you can see it when I work out that I, you know it, it, it's, it's kind of in my game. So, um, you know, I'm working on it, and it's, it's been a you know, it was, it was kind of funny because I got I got so tall and long, and it was just gangly, like when my high school years. So, uh, you know, I was just you know putting it together and been training a lot. So, uh, you know, it's, it's it's fun being growing, uh, getting those guard skills into a six ten body. So, uh, so when your former coach Craig Robinson said you could literally play all five positions, I mean mm -hmm. they say that. Yeah. But you really did. Yeah, I did. I mean, uh, you know, sometimes I had to uh, bring the ball up full court, and, and that was always fun. And, uh, you know, trail ball screen, four man. Uh, sometimes, you know, the Clippers workout, I did uh, five. I was a five man there. So, uh, you know, I've been all over the place. So uh, it's fun. What do you think you have to showcase in these workouts to make you stand out? You just want to compete. You know, at this, at this size, I have a good frame. and. Uh, Really long right now, so you just want to compete. You want to go after every every loose ball, and you want to you want to you make sure you show your voice um, that you uh, that you're out there and helping the teammates and, and just being a good teammate. Uh, like I said, they got their they got the Stephen Curry's, they got their Clay Thompson's, they got the David Lee's. Uh, so you just want to compete and uh, in the intangibles like we talked about in 50-50 balls. Oregon State runs the Princeton offense. Mm -hmm. Safe to say, in these workouts, you sort of feel unleashed. Well, uh, it's different. Uh, you know, the only way you got a post up uh, in the Princeton office was if you did a spin at the top or <laughs> like you got a cut back door. And right. then, uh, you know, I just did what coach wanted me to do up there. I'm not don't want to say that that wasn't a good system. I try to say that I can play any kind of system because I'm a versatile type of player. Yep. But, uh, you know, it's, it, this this is definitely I, I, I like this with the it's more spread and, and, uh, and the pro level. And I think that's fun, and you got more, a lot more room to operate, and uh, quick movement, quick movement. So it's uh, it's fun, and uh, I like I like this a lot. When I see you play, I see like a raw Taj Gibbs. Is mm -hmm. that accurate, or would you say that's different? Well, he asked me over there what, what my uh, comparison was, and the first person I named was Taj Gibson. <laughs> so. Uh, you know, he's like, he asked who I watch, and I, you know, Taj Gibson, pick and pop, mid-range jumper, jab shot, yeah. jab uh, shot, uh, post, defend. If he gets switched on to a, a smaller guy, he can he's, he can move uh, lateral pretty quickly. Um, I like Taj Gibson okay. a lot. You know, he's, he you know gets above the rim by six ten, about the same wingspan. I, yeah. You know, I, I think I think it's a good one. All right. I, I would say that. Now you're 22 years old. What do you say to those who say seniors and 50-year players? Are what they are. They have no upside. Well, like, what's the you know defend you know, that? Well, I, I can def I, I can defend that. You know, one, for one reason, you know, I've been through a lot, and uh, you know, you can bring leadership and, and you know stuff that you've been through and past experience and you know in that type of way. But at the same time, I went through a growth spurt, and it was uh, and how and how that happened. And, and I'm six ten. I'm six ten now, and I have a lot a lot of room to grow. And uh, I'm I'm ready to play right now. But at the same time. I have a lot of room to go. It's like my potential is like just starting. So right. um, you know, I'm 22, but it's not like most 22 years old, uh, 22 year old guys. So uh, you know, I can, I have such a, I feel like I have such a high season, and uh, I feel like in about three, four years, I'll be an all star. Jared Cunningham's from the Bay Area, mm -hmm. and he was with Dallas and Atlanta last year. Did he give you any advice on this process? Uh, I talked to him a lot before I started these workouts. You know, you want, you, you just want to uh, make sure you take care of your body, drink a lot of water, and uh, you know, you're flying all over the place, so you want to stay hydrated. And, and uh, he was really helpful throughout that, and he's been a good friend. And uh, you know, I've, 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 I've taken a lot of uh, uh, 
information from him. And, uh, you know, you just want to keep doing that. I, I've drank so much water now, it's unbelievable. <laughs> so, um, not just because of him, but, you know, a lot of people have told me that. And, uh, you know, he's been really helpful throughout this process. I still talk to him every day almost. So, I'm telling him how the workouts go. And, uh, you know, he's, he's been a good guy. He's been, he's transferred, he's been to like three teams now. So, right. uh, you know, he's, I just listen to everything he has to say and then try to take it. We have your passport ready. You're heading up to Canada. Heading up to Canada. Work out for the Raptors. I am. All right. Well, stay healthy, travel safe. I, I appreciate it. Warriors.com. Well, thank you much. For Eric Moreland, I'm RC Davis for Warriors TV.